Do you know what is at stake here? Nathan Detroit's crap game because of a dog. I cannot believe that a number one businessman like you could let himself go and fall in love with his own fiance. All right, so Adelaide is my weakness. Can you not be tolerant that I have got a weakness? Especially since this weakness is a sad condition that guys are in all over the world? Look, what's playing at the Roxy? I'll tell you what's playing at the Roxy. The picture about a Minnesota man so in love with a Mississippi girl that he sacrifices everything and moves all the way to Biloxi. That's what's playing at the Roxy. What's in the daily news? I'll tell you what's in the daily news. Story about a guy who bought his wife a small ruby with what otherwise would have been his union dues. That's what's in the daily news. What's happening all over? I'll tell you what's happening all over. Guy sitting home by a television set who used to be something of a rover. That's what's happening all over. Love is a thing that has licked them. And it looks like I'm just another victim. Yes, sir. When you see a guy reach for stars in the sky, you can bet that he's doing it for some doll. When you spot a John waiting out in the rain, chances are he's insane, as only a John can be for a Jane. When you meet a gent paying all kinds of rent for a flat that could flatten the Taj Mahal. Call it sad, call it funny, but it's better than even money that the guy is only doing it for some dog. you see a Joe saving half of his dough, you can bet they'll be minking it for some doll. When a bum buys wine like a bum can't afford, it's a cinch that the bum is under the thumb of some little broad. When you meet a mug lately out of the jug, and he's still lifting platinum for the roll. Call it hell, call it heaven, it's a probable 12 to 7 that the guy is only doing it for some time. You see a sport and his cash has run short you can bet he's been blowing it on some doll when a guy wears tails with the front gleaming white who the heck do you think he's tickling pink on saturday night when some lazy slob gets a good steady job and he smells from vitalis and barbasol Call it dumb, call it clever, ah, but you can give odds forever that the guy's only doing it for 